Harlem Globetrotters, basketball wizards extraordinary. Their patented blend of brilliant play and zany capers has made them the most popular team in the history of the sport. Going backstage to a rehearsal session, you see the superb skill that makes their amazing pranks possible. Comedy on the court is their business, so a serious rehearsal has got to be hilarious. In the famous warm-up circle, no one knows what's coming next. It's all ad-lib and anything for a laugh. Even in slow motion, their magical hands fool you. team's handyman, the original Mr. Sticky Fingers. What's the man say? Play ball? Okay, shake on it. So there you are, and here we are in a practice game. The boys in white jerseys know all the trotters' tricks. They've seen them time and again and they're still fooled by them every time. What you do in a case like this? Man lies down on the job, so take the ball away. Not a chance, chum. All you do is get him mad. See what you get? Two points for the Globetrotters. That's the way it goes. Clowning is good for laughs, and it really sets up those baskets. When the pivot man turns on that magic, the other team hasn't got a chance. Man, they're out of this world. Let's see what happens when they play for keeps. You know, basketball is the most popular spectator sport in America, perhaps in the whole world. And this unbelievable group has done more to keep it tops than any other team. In 30 years, they've played all over the world and played before the largest crowds in the history of the sport. It's their own peculiar brand of basketball based on fantastic talent and technique. They seldom lose a game and they always win the crowd. These pre-game shenanigans not only break up the fans with laughter, they break down the other team with amazement. How do they do it, they ask. And they find out the hard way. So the teams face off. Here's the tap up. And out of nowhere, a basket. You figure it out. It's basketball with a touch of magic. Fast action and always the unexpected. Oh, there's a foul, and here's one of the Globetrotters' famous comedy routines. They get a free shot, but they try for a field goal. <laughs> Sometimes the opponents get possession, but never for long. That's when the Trotters really go into high gear. the ball and hey where'd it go oh there it is again the other team gets possession much good it does them finesse or flamboyance whichever is needed these court magicians have it called and the referee wants the ball so they give him the business nothing sacred they're very cooperative like fun 
this penalty isn't in the books, but maybe it fits the crime. But the Globetrotters are irrepressible. He's back, but what about that hat? Keep an eye on this fella. <laughs> and there's the topper. Hats off to the Globetrotters for that one. The opponents shoot, miss, and that's all. The Trotters whip down the court and anything can happen. Again, the hat trick. He was just warming up before. Watch this. <laughs> Superb ball handling is the secret, the key to their game. Watch how a master of the art of dribbling outfoxes the man guarding him. There's another foul, and time is called. A man seems to be injured. There's a brief conference on the sidelines with the team's owner-manager, Abe Saperstein, the man who founded the team and guided it to fame. And the hurt man goes back into the game to take his free shot. But no one takes this brave scene too seriously. No monkey shines, warns the referee. Ready, set. He shoots. How's that for a snappy comeback? But the official doesn't go along with the gang. Angry orders, and a not very chastened globetrotter trades in his rubber band ball for a regulation model. Watch out for tricks. No straight, see? But he looks too innocent. This time, jumping bean ball. <laughs> and that's why referees grow gray. One more chance, and no gimmicks, I promise. So who needs a trick ball with hands like his? It's moments like this that have brought the Harlem Globetrotters their fame. In every country of the civilized world, they performed. And with their comedy, won new friends. They're living proof that laughter makes the whole world kin. Brilliant basketball players that can't help playing it for laughs. And you can't help laughing with them. The one and only Harlem Globetrotters.